So first, we're going to prime our eyes. Um, really, any primer will work. Um, I have used a face primer for my eyes before, um, but I'm just going to use the Elizabeth Mott eyeshadow primer. Um, you can use e.l.f. eyelid primer, you know, Too Faced Shadow Insurance, Urban Decay Primer Potion. Whatever works, it's all up to you. We're just going to get a little bit of that and we're going to put this on our lid and on the brow bone and then I'm going to take the extra and just run it underneath. The color we're going to take is a highlight color. I like to use this white color from the CoverGirl Coffee Shop Quad and normally I take it on a pencil brush. I'm going to use the uh, $1 e.l.f. blending eye brush. I'm obsessed with this brush. Get a little bit of that white color and we're just going to put this as our brow bone highlight. Any uh, precision detail brush like this one. This is the MAC 221 and we're going to take a little bit of this shimmery brown color which is such a pretty color and we're just going to put that as our transition color. We're going to go in with a packing brush. I like to use just a big one. And I'm going to go in with this gold color. We're going to put this on the middle of the look right here. We're going to take a fluffy blending brush. I'm just going to use the MAC 224 and I'm going to take a little bit of this shimmery brown color in the name of Smog and we're just going to put this in our outer corner slash crease. So we're going to take a any fluff brush. I'm just going to use this one. These don't have numbers but it just kind of looks like this. I'm going to take this color champagne eyeshadow and this is in Sin in the world famous Naked palette and we're going to put this in our inner corner. Okay next we're going to take a little bit of this purplish color in the name of Hustle and we're going to take this on uh, really any uh, fluffy blending brush like this one. Uh, it's just a nice tall blending brush. We're going to take a little bit of that color and we're just going to intensify the outer corner. And you can push it into the crease if you want. Any fluffy blending brush, I'm going to use the same MAC 224 brush and we're going to take a little bit of Naked and we're going to just soften it. And then next, we're going to take a little bit of Virgin on really any brush. I'm just going to use a sponge tip applicator and we're going to put this on our brow bone using the sponge tip applicator to do so. With a little bit of smog, and we're going to run this under our lash line. You can take a little bit of black, just a little bit because this black is so pigmented. So just take a wee bit and put it on the lower lash line as well, just on the kind of outer corner of it, and then you can do it on the upper lash line as well. We're going to kind of smoke it out, and I'm going to use the MAC blending brush, and we're going to take a little bit of Naked and a little bit of Buck, just mix them a little bit, and we're just going to tap off the excess and start blending. Waterline, and I'm gonna use this Mr. Right Now in Jack. This is like a black brown color. I love this just because it's just enough brown but dark enough to be noticeable. So I'm tight lining, and then I'm going to line my waterline, my MAC in Extreme Dimension Lash, and my CoverGirl Super Sizer together it up a little bit and I'm going to line my upper lash line and to do that I'm going to use this jumbo eye crayon in sunglasses and we're just going to make a not really thick but not really thin line on our upper lash line and then I'm going to kind of wing it out on the corners using my MAC fluid line and I love this eyeliner so 
lips. Yeah, I'm going to be using a vampy lip. So, um, I'm going to be using two lip colors. I'm going to first, I'm going to apply um, Max Blankety. This is an amplified cream. It's just a nice nude color, not too over nude. And then I'm going to apply LA Colors Sienna over just like it. That. So that would be your completed look. If you want, you could add a bronzer. I just have on a Mary Kay blush in shy blush or something like that but I have on a physician's formula highlight in blonde so I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you next time bye